hello everyone welcome back to my channel thank you guys so much for coming back and if you're new here welcome i am on a budget journey if you guys don't know i am 20 years old i am on my third baby and i kind of wanted to introduce myself to everybody as you can tell by the title today i'm going to be sharing with you guys my amazon packages and 10k stuffing that i made myself it show you that on my ipad i edit i do all that on here so i'm going to show you guys the packages i got from amazon i did already open the little case that i'm going to keep the envelopes in i'm just going to show you guys really quick the box that i chose this is super cheap the time i seen it was all black and like the trimming was silver was at my nearest cvs when i seen it i was like oh my god this would be a good idea to like keep money because it comes with a little lock and I have the little lock in here. I have the extra one in one of my envelopes in my stuffing binder. So this is what it looks like. It's so cute. And then you can actually like lock it. Any adult can break into this, but I thought my kids wouldn't. So if I have it anywhere like displayed, honestly, probably no one would know. They probably think it's makeup, but I don't have it displayed. I have it in a safe spot. So I got this. I didn't want to buy anything expensive. I could have went to Dollar Tree and got those bins but honestly like i said i wanted something like a little bit more cuter this is what it looks like this is the inside it's just black of course <laughs> um oh my god i just i love this box so much so i was thinking with that i was gonna get some envelopes and i didn't want to spend so much money on envelopes on etsy like i'm on a budget so why would i spend so much in my amazon package i already opened it i looked at it but i didn't open this to like check them out so that's what I'm gonna be showing you. There is supposed to be a hundred little black envelopes. Oh, it's this way. I'm over here trying to peel it. Okay. Okay, so there is five of these. Come on. So these are the envelopes I got for I think like $8.49, basically $9. And like I said, I didn't want to spend too much money on envelopes. Maybe one day, if I decide to open an Etsy shop, I probably have simple ones like this, honestly. Because I feel like I'm so simple. I don't like design. I like everything to look modern. And I don't know. That's just me. I don't like too much clutter. Like everything's so minimal. And I didn't want to do too much. Um, so I wanted to take one of these out to show you. So I thought I did the measurements right but the envelopes are a bit bigger so i'm not able to put them the way i wanted to put them like this way i wanted to put them in like this okay so it folds right here so i did want to put them like this but that's not gonna fit so i was thinking maybe i put them side by side and i'm not gonna put any numbers on them i was thinking we do one side the ones that we filled up already and it should close perfectly fine once i fold these up so i don't want to write anything on them because if i have to use them like if i ever want to get rid of them i didn't write on them i don't have to just throw them out i can just literally repurpose them so i don't want to put numbers in these i count how much we have so maybe we can just take them out and count So, I'm hoping this is 100. Like, I want to make sure. So, we are going to be counting these so we know what we're working with in case they missed one, but I doubt it. Okay. And these. There's so much. Okay, let's just count these first. I don't want to take all of them out. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16
see. I just want to make sure they're all in one spot. So that's going to be 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 69, 100. So we have 100 here. I do want to actually stuff some of these, but I also want to like already fold them in. If you know what I mean. So I'm, I do want to put this flap inside of these like this. So when I put it in, it's easier. So I do want to do that to all of them. I know it sounds crazy, but I just feel like it'll be easier to just kind of slip in and keep it in place so it's neater. Because I'm, I'm not licking them. You can if you want, but like I said, I do want to reuse this if I have to. So, maybe if I just like do these fast like this. So, I'm new to this budgeting channel. Like, let me know in the comments down below if you guys have like any questions or any suggestions. And I love to listen to other people's advice, other people's ideas, or anything like that. Or if you guys want to see something in particular, I have a lot of videos coming. It's just obviously I get paid every two weeks. And then this is just like starting off my channel basically with everything that I'm doing and the things I'm saving for. It's the beginning of my journey and I'm really excited to like join this community. Honestly, there's so many of you guys and a lot of people are so supportive here. I feel like no one sits there on comments and judges anybody, which I love and I just... I love everybody's setup, everyone's nails. I know I'm so random, but honestly, I'm just trying to get these <laughs> envelopes out the way. Honestly. I've been waiting for these envelopes longer than I was the box because we had we were snowed in and then we also had like hail coming from the sky like a day after the snowstorm. And then I stayed at work for literally three days crazy right then the car didn't want to start it's an older model so yeah it was so bad like that week was bad i feel like i don't want to talk about the bad but like my week was like crap so doing videos like this literally motivates me when things like that happen in my life but i was okay i got paid it wasn't like i didn't so yeah these envelopes are almost done i should start picking them up I'm putting them away. See what I mean? They're like the flap kind of sticks out when you put them in. So if I just put them in like this, they won't be all like, you know, bumping into each other and all that. So I'm going to do that as well. Let me know what is your goal for this year on any of your envelopes. I would like to know that. I think it'll be kind of interesting. So my budget is like to just fill up the money and just see where I get this year. And then by next year, I'll have like a certain budget that I want for every envelope. Like I said, I'm starting this. So I don't really have a budget for anything at the moment because I do pick up shifts and then I have, I'm a part timer. So it just depends on how much I work and over time um holidays and things like that so like i said it just depends Now that all of it is all folded up and ready to go, all I have to do is literally open it like this and just put the money in. Literally that simple. I don't mind the flap, but honestly, I didn't want the flap. I just wanted it to be like simple to put in. So I'm going to go ahead and put these in there. They're not going to fit all in one side, obviously. So I think I'm going to end up making something to put in between of these. So I'm able to... Um, know which ones are stuffed and which ones are not this 
honestly could take a while for me to save this 10k but it's okay i'm not in a rush i have other savings and stuff and like i'm saving for other reasons but i just wanted it to be fun while saving and yeah so that's kind of that i'm gonna go ahead and just pop this right on the side i want to add a little on this side but it looks so nice i love it now that it's all folded in i can definitely close it it looks like honestly it's so satisfying just seeing them all in here so i did want to stuff this i'm actually kind of excited after i'm all done showing you guys the planner that i made for this challenge i'm gonna actually i want to make sure this doesn't fold i do have some leftover money from my last paycheck when i had extra i think i had like almost a hundred and something dollars extra or 200 and the little change i had instead of rolling it over or anything like that i just kept it because i did want to start this challenge so that is basically what i'm going to show you guys how i made my planner to start everything so this is what it looks like it says 100 envelope challenge 10k and yeah so what i did was do 10 rows across and 10 rows down and that equals if you do 10 times 10 it equals 100 so that's what i did and then i started from 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 16 18 20 etc i did screen record some of it so i will be showing you guys that as well because it took a while because the way this good notes is set up it's really weird i'll show you guys in a minute what i mean really end it's a hundred i'm gonna go all the way um start from two four six eight you want to do the even numbers the end you're gonna put a hundred and that's the only thing that's different is this one right down here this random hundred and it all equals 10k so what i did was i'm gonna show you really quick i'm gonna add um a screen squared paper so this is what i use with square paper and I zoomed in a lot so I counted 10 across and what I ended up using was just a marker and then they have this setting that has a square circle and a triangle and I click that for 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 there we go so now I'm gonna move my way down and we're gonna do the same thing 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 perfect see and then you just go across oops what are you doing okay there we go and it'll literally fix the line perfectly for you and this is how i got my little setup of the squares as you can tell and then um once i put my numbers in you there's like a text here and you can pick whatever you wanted the only thing i did not like about this was every time i put a number in I would have to change the font and change the number size that i wanted and i did all that this is what i got out of it i screenshot it cropped it out and this is what it came out like so neat it looks so much better than any of the ones that are online i feel like they're just so crowded and i wanted to be able to see the numbers clearly so i really like that so once i did that i came here to pick art and then you just add a photo I added the back right so that's what I did and then down here it says add photo so what I did was just added the photo that I wanted and you click add again and it's super small but all you have to do is just zoom it in as much as you wanted and that's basically what I did and from here I just saved it um how do I save it oopsie I think that's how I save it yeah done that's what I do and then I went back on good notes and I used the same font for the this I used for the lettering on it and that's pretty much all, how I did it I did save some money last week I get paid bi-weekly and last week I saved about almost a hundred to two hundred dollars of groceries and this was left over of the groceries I was gonna roll it over or do like the one dollar challenge but I think I'm gonna start the one dollar challenge next week so i'm like you know something maybe i can get my 10k box started with this little bit of money that i have i'm gonna go ahead and count it for you guys like i said it's not really much literally there's like nothing so it's 10 15 16 17 18 19 20. so this 20 like i said it's not much but it's something right to start my 10k anything goes a long way Bring on the box. 
since we have $20, I did want to stuff some of these. I'm going to go ahead and use this like brown color here to color it in. I'm super excited. So what I was thinking we do, we could probably, so we have 20. Yes, I was thinking we stuff a 10 and then we stuff a an 8 and a 2. So those are the ones we're going to stuff today. The $2 one first. So $2. I'm so excited to start this. Super excited. I think I'm going to start on the right here with this. These ones are bugging me since they're not like neatly. Okay, perfect. Start with the right side. Once I start getting a little more, I think I will make like a stopper for it. But right now, I don't have anything. I would have to go to Dollar Tree or something. And then the next one. So we did the $2 one. So let's color that in. $2 one. Now we're going to do the $8 one. So we just need 5, 6, 7, 8. That's eight dollars there. And then let's fill that in. This one. And then we're gonna do a ten dollar one. Like I said, I'm so excited for this to start building. And another thing too though, I just, I'm not in a rush for it. But if I can, you know, stuff stuff it as much as I can, because 10K is a lot. I know I've seen some that were um, 10K in 100 days or 52 weeks, I think that's what it was. So like in a year. I'm like, I don't know if I can do that. We'll see though, we'll see how everything works out. I don't know, these are like not, <laughs> these are like bugging me that they're not closed, but. Oh, we didn't color this one in. Alright, so that's pretty much it. I stuffed $20 for the first time in my 100 envelope challenge. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys like my content, make sure to subscribe and also like or leave a comment. If you guys are also a budgeter, I would love to subscribe back to you guys. Honestly, I love watching other budgeting channels and other people's journeys. This is my journey. Bye, guys.